Well, we just got the news that we're not allowed to go to college anymore because they're afraid that somebody might cough in a crowd. It's so disappointing because I was right in the middle of this really cool film class and we were supposed to remake a scene from one of our favorite movies and I wanted to do a silent film adventure serial for our final project. But none of that's gonna happen now. And I got stuff to do for the TV station too. Guess the show's going on hiatus. This is irritating. One person did have the brilliant idea, however, that uh, for our film class we could uh, make these self-contained quarantine videos. Just so that we can continue making something. So I'll let you know how that turns out. Oh yeah, this is my uh, brother over here. He also can't go to class right now. So we're stuck together for the time being. Say hi. Look, man, I don't have time to participate in your little documentary or whatever's going on. I'm working on uh, finishing up some video projects that we started before all this happened. Fortunately, editing can be done from home, so I'm doing that. When I finish, I guess I'll probably, I don't know, uh, work on some theory videos or something for one of my YouTube channels. Just know that there's something productive I could be doing. Maybe. I'll start working on a comic book and actually finish it this time. Day seven. It's been really pretty outside recently, but despite the fact that fresh air and sunshine are great for people, especially if they're trying to recover from something, I keep getting emails from the school telling us to stay inside, lock our doors, and close our blinds. Look at that beautiful day out there. Should be outside frolicking in the sun, riding a bicycle, having fun. But I hear the virus is spreading, making people crazy. Apparently. Some people, despite this, are going to work still. Essential or something. Of course, I can't go back to work, because I used to work on the college campus. And for all the hype, there should be zombies out in the streets. Almost wish there were. Yeah, I could go and fight them. Day 15. I couldn't take it anymore. I had to get outside and get some fresh air and sunshine. That and we, uh, we ran out of toilet paper. You know, toilet paper's become quite the valuable commodity. Despite what people need is hand sanitizer. I mean, do we really need to be reminded to wash our hands? That should be something we do all the time anyway. Bro, well, why did you have to drag me all the way out here? I was perfectly fine at the house. I needed backup, all right? and. The store was barricaded, so the baseball fields are open, and the only place I could think of that might have some toilet paper. Crap. Well, desperate times calls for desperate measures. <laughs> Found some toilet paper in there. This stuff is like gold these days. Yes, sir. -y. There was a moldy one in there, so I just I just left it for the next guy. I know that uh, that sounds apathetic, but that's what the apocalypse will do to you. Oh, it's not the apocalypse, man. What are you talking about? Well, what are you totally doing filming this? It's like, give me that thing. What do you think you're doing? Come on. My brother thinks it's the apocalypse. Not that it is or anything, but 
This allows him to play out his little adventure fantasies. <laughs> Man, what a nerd. I mean, look at him. Look, look at this dude. Look at, look at him standing up there. It's just... He's actually... He's brooding. Pretty sure he's brooding now. He has to drag me into this too. And he likes it. He likes dragging me into it. Survival instincts, I guess. <laughs> what a nut job. Empty baseball fields. Nostalgia's a cruel mistress. I used to come here and play as a kid. After I got out of Little League, I'd still try to get my friends together to uh, play different games. I'd always get them together for different projects and events, but as time went on and they would graduate or get jobs, get married, whatever, it always got harder and harder till I was the only one left on the field, as it were, out here. Still playing. My heart's content. Adventure. Come on, man, I'm hungry. Well, we got what we had come for, so um, now we're just going to uh, go on back. Oh no! It's the infected! What? It's, it's the infected! Ow. Run! Ow. Run! Just employees! Run! Come on! Get in the truck! Get in the truck! Hey! Y'all, it's, it's it's totally fine. Like, oh no! Sorry about this. I, ah! Boy, what the heck? I wasn't even in the truck. I'm really sorry about this. We're, it's it's okay. We got the toilet paper. It's ours. You can't have it. Day 20. My razor broke yesterday, so now I can't shave anymore. You might be wondering why I have this gun. Well, the other day. We went on uh, another TP raid, and this time my brother wasn't fast enough, so I had to lock him in this room. For the love of... Just, I'm not infected, okay? Let me out now! You know those guys were just city employees, right? Essential workers doing their part to stop the flow of this terrible pandemic. It's feeding time again. Step away from the door, or you will be shot at. <laughs> Gotta wash my hands again. Day 23! There's people from the park! The infected ones! They came back! I don't know how they found us or what they want! Give us that toilet paper back! Come on, I'm gonna have to take them out, I'm afraid! But with only a few shots left, I might have to resort to melee. Wish I had a uh, matching sword, but you gotta work with what you gotta work with. Yeah, that's right, run! Day 28, or was it 29? It seems I misread the email, and classes were not actually canceled. They were either postponed or put online. So now I've missed half the semester. It also seems that the, uh, the virus is uh, fading out or going away. Either that or it's getting worse and uh, we're all going to be stuck under martial law. I'm not sure right now. Hi. So that's Oh no. Hey, no. you know what? Getting shot at point blank range with an airsoft gun, it really hurts. Oh no. Let's see how you like it. Oh, no. ah, 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 how does it feel? Ah, how does it feel? Ah, you're ah. Oh, 
Ouch. I think I'm gonna give this up for now and go back to school or work or whatever I'm allowed to do. So, um, I guess this has been my quarantined, uh, quarantine report. Signing off. I would give back the toilet paper, but, um, I already used it and I don't think they want it back now. <laughs>